Thanks for watching my channel. I'm Brian Johnson with Windermere Valley Liberty Lake. When you ask the question, how many people live in Spokane, you're going to get three answers that are generally correct. Around 200,000 people, around 500,000 people, or around 700,000 people. It completely depends on how you define Spokane or how many people live in this area. And let's go ahead and jump into my computer and I'm going to show you how many people live in Spokane and how it breaks apart from that 200,000 to that 700,000 number. So to know the population of Spokane, let's first talk about the city of Spokane and the population there. So looking here on the map of Spokane County, right here in the green in the very center is the city of Spokane. And its population right now is 227,579 people. And this is in 2021. We're recording this in December of 2021. And if we go a little bit around town here, Airway Heights, which is right over here, that's got about 10,203 people. Medical Lake, which is right over here, we've got 5,024 people. Cheney, which is down below here, that's 12,862 people. Mead, which is yeah, right up in here in Spokane, right in North Spokane, 7,114 people. Deer Park, which is up here way north of Spokane, about, yeah, about 30 minutes, you know, half of a Led Zeppelin album to get there. 4,630 people. Now, Spokane Valley, that's a big city. When you people think of Spokane and Spokane Valley being a very different, it's a different city, but it literally is across the street. Spokane Valley has 104,564 people. I think a lot of times people want to combine those numbers when they come up the population of Spokane, but you don't want to do that. You won't get the right number. Liberty Lake has about 11,784 people. I think that is off by one because I know someone that just had a baby. Now let's go into the county and this is where people when they think of the population of Spokane and you hear that bigger number of 500,000 people. That's the entire county of Spokane. So that's everything you see here on the map including people that just live obviously right in here. And the population of Spokane County in 2021 is 541,188 people. And again that's off by one. And um and so I think that's why that's going to be when people think of they hear oh there's about half a million people here in Spokane. Well, that's what they really mean is how many people are in Spokane County. But you can see when you talk about the city of Spokane, it's a lot different than Spokane County or if people are including the valley or any of that in their calculations. Now, comparing Spokane to the other areas that we have around here with big populations, you can see that over in Tacoma, which Spokane's a little bigger than Tacoma, they say, <laughs> 221,000 people. Seattle, 776,000 people. And down in Boise, you're looking at about 229,000 people. Now, these stats are really deceiving because I can tell you both Boise is a much bigger city than Spokane. You go look at the downtown core. And obviously, Seattle, Tacoma is wildly different than Spokane. Tacoma, you know, is a giant, it, it's, that's just the city limits of Tacoma, which is not Fircrest or all the other little teeny communities that are technically right there in Tacoma. To show the real difference of Tacoma or Boise to Spokane, let's look at the densities. Now to know the real difference between these areas when we're talking about the density and how crowded it is Seattle and Tacoma and Boise versus Spokane, right here you've got the density of each one of these areas. So over here, Pierce County, this is Tacoma. Your density is 4,446 people per square mile. In Seattle, you have 9,260 people per square mile. In Spokane, you have 3,309 per square mile. And down in Boise, you have 2,748 per square mile. But the reason that Boise is considered so much bigger than Spokane, well, one reason, is because of the other counties. In Spokane, you've just got the one county. In the Boise, you've got this um, metropolitan statistical area, and Boise is very spread out. So I'll show you that here in just a second. But Tacoma versus Spokane. Spokane, you know, we're a little bigger city, but look at this density difference between Seattle, I mean, between Spokane and Tacoma. You're looking at almost 1,100 people per square mile denser in Tacoma, and it really, really shows over there in the traffic. But even look at this is crazy in Seattle. 
You've got almost three times the people in the same tight little spot in Seattle. You're at 9,260 people per square mile, which is wildly, wildly more people. And it shows in the traffic over there versus Spokane. Now, they also have these things called combined statistical areas or metropolitan statistical areas. So that's when you think of a general area, how many people live there. So you can see over on the other side, in Seattle, Tacoma, that, that metropolitan area, you've got about 4 million people packed in that into that area over there in Seattle, Tacoma. In Boise, this is that combined metropolitan statistical area, and it's 749,000, and that's in the Boise, Nampa County areas right here. But really, why, another reason why you have a bigger city or a bigger feel of a, a city over there is because you have a little bit larger group of people there when you include the these areas in this combined statistical area of 811,000 people are around Boise, Idaho. And for us here in Spokane, this is why you hear that 700,000 people in this area, because we've got the Spokane Coeur d'Alene combined statistical area. And that is right here. You've got Spokane County, you've got the Coeur d'Alene, you know, right area right here in Idaho. And then also you have the two counties above Washington, above Spokane that are counted into our statistical area for like the inland northwest and that's where they come up with that much much larger number of 700 you can see it right here and this is in 19 so we're behind by a couple years it's harder for them to get these numbers i couldn't pull them off of the um census like i could the others but 734,218 people in our combined you know area of where we live here in spokane when you think generally speaking in this area people coming to spokane people in this area and all the little towns and communities we're about 734,000 plus, that one person in Liberty Lake I was telling you about, in this general area. Well, I hope that helps. Now you know the population of Spokane, Spokane County, and our combined general area. If you have any questions about real estate, again, my name is Brian Johnson with Windermere Valley, Liberty Lake. Feel free to reach out anytime. Send me a message, shoot me a text, send me an email. And if you're from out of the area and you need help with real estate, feel free to reach out. I can find you an agent in your area and I'd love to help. Thanks again.